this out. There's so much crap in there. And now we're down this far, but we're straightening posts and everything before we can put the fence on. But it's coming along. It's much better out today. Okay, here is our fence we're putting in. <laughs> Here's the trouble corner because his post is right up on ours and then I don't know if I can show you at the bottom. He's got a board that comes all the way over into our yard. What's this <laughs> Showing the fine people our fence we're putting in. Okay, good evening. It is Sunday at quarter to six. And I uh, just thought I'd come on here and tell you how my weekend went, which was very good. It was very good eating wise. I had um, banana for breakfast yesterday because my husband and I went to church to do stuff. And I had my salad for lunch. And then last night I made my smoked sausage with sauerkraut. One of my um, subscribers told me how she makes it. So I made it like that. And it was delicious. Um, and we had corn on the cob with that. I did make some homemade cinnamon rolls last night or yesterday during the day. They came out delicious. I did, I made some smaller and then the other ones are big. So the bigger ones are the boys and I took, I made myself a couple of small ones. Um, they came out delicious. I had one last night and I had one this morning with my breakfast. I just had two pieces of my homemade bread for toast. And then for lunch, I had my salad. And then for dinner, I'm making some homemade mac and cheese, which I'm going to go get to right now. Um, because the boys went out train watching and stuff. We've been getting our fence going and it's been, it's always something when you start a project. <laughs> like nothing goes how you want it to go. The boys worked out in the rain and cold all day yesterday, just in that one corner where you see we got the fence on, just resetting two posts because that's how bad the, the ground is up there. There's a lot of stuff from the neighbor's yards that have like, creeped its way into our yard that they had to pull out and dig out and it's just a mess. So that took them all day yesterday. And uh, so today we got a couple fence pieces put in and we're just going to keep moving from there. It's going to be a slow going thing, but that's all right. It, it, what we got in looks, I think it looks really nice. Um, because the fence are taken down. It's just falling apart as we're taking it down. It's so bad. It's probably, we're, we're trying to figure, they have been here a long time and they think it's at least 30 years old. So, um, cause they said it, the people before the people we bought the house from, um, put it in and they were here, they were here the longest. And then, well, now we've been here the longest, but the couple that bought it from them were here only five years and then we bought it and we've been here 22 years. So, um, so they were thinking it's got to be at least 30 years old <laughs> and it's really held up good for 30 years. So, but it's getting, it's very brittle. It's time. So that's going pretty good. Um, what else is going on? We're just keeping busy. I was going to get some sewing done. But I ended up outside with them helping him today because um, my son had to get some homework done. And that's about it. So I'm going to go make this macaroni cheese, get it in the oven. I'm going to get in the shower and get comfy for the night because I'm exhausted. It's still cool here today, but it's not terribly, it's not like damp and wet like it was yesterday. Um, but that cool air really tires you out. Um, I'm probably sunburned too because it is sunny here for a change. Um, so I think that is it. That was my weekend. Um, we had a real good weekend. We did cheese this morning at church. We got cheese patties ready for pierogi making tomorrow night. We start our six weeks of that. Um, I, I don't know if I'm going tomorrow night to make pierogies or not. I will let you in on a secret. I hate it. <laughs> it's not that I hate it. It's just um, the reason why I hate it is because there's one sit down job, which I do not want. 
because it's just rolling, making dough balls out of the big buckets of dough. And by the end of the night, I can barely move my hands when I do that job. Um, the other job would be to um, press the cheese into the dough and make the pierogi. Um, you stand in one spot for about two to three hours. I cannot stand that. My back can't take just standing still for that long. Or you could be a crimper, but yet again, you're standing still for that long. Or you could boil them and you're standing still. <laughs> So the only job there is that I like to do is take the dough balls and put them through the dough machine and walk them to everybody and then walk, you know, keep, you move, you get to move. And that I like to do, but there's other, there's some of the guys like to do that stuff. Like the one guy, he likes to sit, he's lazy. So he, he likes to do the sit down job, but what you cannot get through to these people is like, it's dough. So they they put all this flour on the table and then they knead the dough. I'm like, it's not a yeast dough. You do not need to knead this dough. All you're doing is adding flour to it, to it and making it stiffer. And then like, I didn't go the last time and my husband didn't get home till like nine. And he's like, oh my God, the dough was terrible. I said, what was wrong with it? He's like, it was so dry. I said, I know. I'm like, these guys think that they need to add all this flour and knead dough that has no yeast in it is not going to rise. It does not need to be kneaded. <laughs> so I would like to go in a, in a way and just say, you know, the reason this dough isn't coming out for you people is because you're adding more flour and, and kneading like they'll, they'll like, like knead it. Like, like it's going to rise. I'm like, it's, it's not. <laughs> It's not that kind of dough. So, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if I go. We'll see how much homework my kid has. If he's got a lot of homework, I'm just going to stay home with him and do his homework. So, we'll see. But, yeah, there's just, I, I hate it because you cannot move around. You've got to be sitting or standing in one spot. And my back cannot take that. And I'm, I know it's my weight. I'm not, you know, that's why, I, like, my back will hurt me a lot. And my husband's like, you need to go to the doctor. I'm like, no. Yeah, I know what they're going to say. It's your weight. It's your weight. Well, if you lose some weight, I said, I will say I have a bad cough or a toothache. And I'll be told, well, if you lose some weight. So I said, I don't, I don't bother because they're just going to tell me I need to lose weight. I know I need to lose weight. So I don't know. But anyway. So we'll see if I go tomorrow night. It's just going to depend. My son has this one project due. Um, they have to make a diorama. And it's in religion. So it's. Um, he, he They had to pick a certain. Something to do. So. Um, I'm going to see what he's got to do for that. Because. Um, I might. Make him. Or not make him. I might have him use like my hot glue gun and stuff. Um, sometimes that's easier to glue that stuff than the Elmer's glue because you have to, you know, it doesn't, it doesn't, you know, what do I want to say? It takes forever to dry. That's what I'm trying to say. So anyway, I will let you go. I'll be with you tomorrow to let you know, um, what we're having, what I'm eating. I don't know what we're going to have for breakfast yet. Um, I think I have pancakes on the menu, which I fixed for my son this morning. I, I have some frozen ones that I made last week and froze, um, cause the batch makes so many, <laughs> but they're so good. So it might be pancakes for him. I don't know. I enjoy having an egg and an English muffin and bacon and stuff. So, um, that might be for me and probably my usual lunch, but we're having chicken for dinner. So, not sure how I'm going to fix that. I'll have to look up some recipes because I, I tend to do the same things all the time. And I still never did make those mashed potatoes yet because we ended up not having our beef roast last week because we had so many leftovers. So um, I think I have it on the menu this week, though. So anyway, have a great rest of your weekend and have a good week coming up. And I will hopefully see you all tomorrow.